Poodles, Richard Ryder here with this week on Out TV. On Monday's episode of Lady Boys, we explore the sleepy fishing village of Patea, which is now becoming a huge center for the Lady Boys. I think it's ironic that it's a fishing village. Seven million visitors came to Pattaya last year, 20% more than the year before. Many come to experience the exotic nightlife, including the city's famous Lady Boys. A lot of people view Pattaya as the city of sin, which it is in a lot of respects. It's just always alive, there's always something happening. Just a great place to be. On Tuesday's brand new episode of In the Kitchen, Sexy Stefano shows us how to make three easy and delicious packed lunches that'll keep you out of the food court. I'd like him to pack my lunch. Today, I've got three packable lunch recipes that will keep you out of the food court. First, I'm sharing a secret family recipe, my mom's minestrone soup. It's made with beans and a whole lot of veg. Then, my tomato, cucumber, and bocconcini grain salad. Next, we're getting a little fancy with my chicken salad sandwich with apples and walnuts. It's sweet, crunchy, nice change from your regular deli sandwich. And finally, my chocolate crunch is going to make you smile. You guys ready? Also on Tuesdays, we've got the brand new series, Psycho Kitties. You got a cat with a problem? Well, call Pam. She'll help you tame that ferocious pussy. I said pussy. Today, we're featuring Manik with her feline personification of evil, Mia. All right, let's get Pam in here. Known as the queen of cat behavior, Pam has written seven groundbreaking books helping cat owners everywhere understand how their cats think. Now, she's here to help you with your psycho kitty. On Wednesdays, we've got back-to-back -back episodes of the A-List New York. This week, the boys try to get some much-needed R&R. What they need to relax from, I have no idea. I was in the mood for a party without Austin showing up. So I called all my friends and invited them to a last minute drag party. Plus I wanted an excuse to put on some red lipstick and show off my new luscious lips. You can take off whatever you want. Take it off. Yeah, yeah. All right, put the kids down for a nap because Out TV's taking you to the movies. On Tuesday, we've got the premiere of Changing Climate, Changing Times. This is a documentary style movie about the end of the world, so you know, it's gonna be fun. In Paris, the weather patterns have entirely changed. Now it rains more in the winter and summers are hotter and hotter. You could move somewhere else, start again. She has just enough water to hold out until the rain comes. But elsewhere, it's the opposite. It's water that threatens life. On Thursday, we've got the premiere of South of the Moon. This is the story of a 12-year-old swimmer who, on the cusp of his sexual awakening, gets an opportunity to go to Vancouver to train with an Olympic team on oh, that spandex. That's all you know how to do. Hit me. Don't let that grown-up stuff get you. It's not about you anyway. A broken heart I can't go away for three years. I'm not even sure if I've got what it takes to become an Olympic swimmer. So what were you boys doing in there last night, huh? Such noise. And on Saturday, we're watching Vampire Lovers. This classic movie from the 70s is chock-a-block with lesbian vampires. So you know it's a tearjerker. The enemies I sought were no ordinary mortals. They were murderers from beyond the grave. How beautiful you are. And at certain times, their evil spirits thrust out from their moldering tombs to strangle and exhaust at a single feast. I'm Richard Ryder, and until next week, that was this week on Out TV. Toodles, poodles.